down, don't mean up and truck it. We gonna do what they say can be done. We've got a long way to go and a short time to get there. I'm eastbound to watch old bandit run. Now keep your foot hard on the pedal, son, never mind them brakes. Let it all hang out cause we gotta run to make. Well, the boys are thirsty in Atlanta and there's beer in Texarkana. We'll bring it back no matter what it takes. He's found it down, go beat up and Today, we got Hydro motherfucking Highmore on the Notorious Dipper channel. What up, y'all? Notorious Dipper here. And I just wanted to tell y'all about something we go through. About every one of us. Everyone in the world. We go through this phase where we listen to NWA really loud, throwing a fat dip. And sometimes you can't hear us when we're talking in our dip videos. So I'm sorry. Damn. Don't get so fucking angry. I just like to enjoy my dip as I'm, you know, educating on the flavor. You know? You get me? Dip on. What is up, you guys? Notorious Dipper here. And I, I'm excited today. I am really excited today because I am here with a new dipper. I don't know if this motherfucker's making a channel or not. <laughs> He is going under the name of Hydro Highmore. Here he is. Introduce yourself, motherfucker. I am Hydro Highmore. Oh, Alright, so I'll do a quick little interview with you. Are you going to be making a dip video channel? I don't know. I'm thinking about it. He's unsure, ladies and gentlemen. This unsure motherfucker. So, you never know. You never know. So, I'm going to expect that to be the answer for every question I ask him. You never know. Because that's just the way this motherfucker rolls. So, today, we are going to be dipping some Grizzly Mint. You know, just to kick down the video, because I really wanted to do this video with uh, Hydro here. So, here it is. Grizzly Mint. Crack the can. And as you can see, it is an uncracked can, ladies and gentlemen. And I am going to let you pack the first lip, my man. Man, let's see if I can pack. Alright. Hydro right, is sort of a beginner dipper. He is, a, he is uh, learning I'm, the ropes. I'm learning the ropes. This kid taught me how to pack. I'm not that good. But he can handle a dip in his lip. So let's see it happen. I can't pack, man. I'm too retarded. Alright. All right. <laughs> As notorious, do the good old packy pack. Form there. Here you go. No, I'm not that good at dipping. So I'm gonna take a. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's a sexy looking pinch. It is. Oh. Oh. Mm. Alright. Oh, see, he's enjoying it. He's like, oh, mm. oh, oh, yeah. The boy's looking. That's satisfaction on that man's face there. You, ain't ha you ain't never had no grizzly mint before, have you? This mother trucker has never had grizzly mint. So, uh, I'm going to pack me a lip now. So, what are you thinking so far? I know you've had grizzly wintergreen. What, how, how's it sitting in your lip? It is sitting in his lip damn good. And he is a beginner dipper here, ladies and gentlemen. So I'm going to tell y'all something. Grizzly Wintergreen. I mean, man. Wintergreen? What the fuck is that? <laughs> what am I talking about? Grizzly Mint is not a bad beginner dipper dip. He's feeling it. He's liking it. How's, how's the flavor? What's the flavor like? <laughs> It is definitely a very minty dip. It's like a burn in your mouth kind of a burn. It's so really nice. Smooth. Perfect. So, if you're a beginner dipper, when you throw in some grizzly mint, you do get a little bit of a burn. But a seasoned veteran dipper like me, I've been dipping for four years, and I just consider myself that. You know, I've been around, tried a lot of dips, and uh, I don't get a burn from this. So if you are a vet dipper, this ain't gonna burn you lip. So what do you think about the moistness of the chew in the can when you looked at it? Com compared to other dips, you know? Compared, damn. Compared to other 
Yeah. So, Grizzly and Skull are, uh, you know, their cuts are different, and they're both, you know, a little drier than Copenhagen kids. You know, and he's he just said like, and I said this in my last video. I said that Skull Classic was just about as dry as Grizzly Man, and he just compared it to Skull. I didn't even fucking ask this motherfucker, and he knew it. Just tells y'all that I know my dip shit. <laughs> now what is that can? Huh? Let me see that can. Long cut. Oh damn. I've got me some barrels of I don't know what the hell this shit is, but I'm gonna drink it. It's Smurf Jizz, and I'm drinking it. Damn. Molly's had four bottles of Smurf semen already. Yep. Oh, I mean hydro. I mean hydro. I mean hydro. Sure. <laughs> you go, so, now I'm gonna kick it down the end of Tories with the official review of this dip. But before I do that, the dip lit of the day, as chosen by me and Hydro, you agree on this dip lit? Yes, he agrees on this dip lit. It is Grizzly Wintergreen Camo. And you know, grizzly lids are hard to bend. I don't even try and uh, crack them out of the can. But I think it's because they're made by a completely different company. But I won't digress. Here's what Grizzly Mint is like. As far as dips come, it's a little bit dry. Wouldn't you say? It is. It's drier than Grizzly Wintergreen? Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's drier. Is it drier dip? And, uh,. You know, it, it's like the mintiest dip I've had. You know, it's the best flavored mint. I haven't had Copenhagen mint, so I want y'all to get to me on that and tell me if it's better than this shit. I assume it is, because Cope's the best, but, uh... <laughs> besides Copenhagen mint, this is a good mint dip. It's a good flavor, good, fresh, you know... Fairly long lasting flavor. A fairly long lasting flavor, yeah? Yeah. So, first, first two I ever did. Now that's pussy. First, if you did camel snuts, who did you get your camp from? I got it for Brian. There's some guy you're hanging out with? I could hang out with Jen, but I'm getting drunk and shit. And he's like, hey, you're drunk and dip. Doing the dip. So, so. Listen to this, listen to this scenario. He's hanging out with a bunch of dudes getting drunk in Malala, dipping candle snicks. And we live in Oregon, so that's Malala, Oregon. So there are a bunch of dudes getting drunk, dipping Campbell snooze, and he gets punched in the face. I'm not, I'm not hating, but it sounds like a gay beat-up party. <laughs> a little bit, man. If it was Skull Apple instead of uh, Campbell snooze, I'd know for sure that it is a gay beat-up party. Well, but the guy, one guy had Grizzly. Yeah, I, I tried that, and I was like, I almost threw up. I'm pussy. I'm pussy. But as you all know, if you watched uh, my video comparing Copenhagen Extra Long Cut Natty to Skull Classic, then you would know that, that's my brother that just went out, then you would know that, uh, I just forgot what the fuck I was going to say. <laughs> I absolutely just forgot. <laughs> this is pretty damn good. Yeah, so as a beginner dipper, uh, it has a good nicotine content. Uh, it's not giving me much of a buzz. You're probably getting a buzz though, huh? This man's getting a buzz. So if you're a beginner dipper, this is a good, smooth dip. And it will, it will give you a buzz. Man. I love this. And how much did you get this for? 
Um, up here in Oregon, you have to pay more because of uh, deposit or tax or some shit like that. We're paying around five bucks a can uh, for dip here in Oregon. I noticed that in other places uh, like Idaho, Minnesota, places like that, dip is like two bucks. And you get more exclusive dips like Copenhagen Southern Blend and Copenhagen Mint, which I hear is only in Texas. I'm going to Texas. You're going, going to Texas, Texas this summer. Get some right I'll, I'll do it. I'll bring it back. Though. Yes. I can. I'll bring it back. I'll make you do that and So be expecting a Copenhagen Mint video, you motherfucker, because we're going to do it in the future. It's going to happen. You can't stop us. Copenhagen Mint! So the notorious dipper rating for Grizzly Man, as far as mint dips go, a dip itself, I would give this dip a, uh, I'd give this dip an 8. What, is, what would you say? Well, it's a number one dip, maybe like 40 times. I don't think much. I don't think much. So Volley gives it an 8. So there you go. The notorious dipper rating and Hydro High More rating is an 8, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, so there it is. Hydro and Notorious give this an 8. Um, damn. Damn. He's like, it. you're loving it? I'm loving it, dude. He's loving this fucking dip. So if you're a beginner, try this dip out. Um, ah. It is a good motherfucking dip, and I'm about to wrap this video up. So is there anything you want to say to all the dippers out there, Hydro? To this shit, I'm a fucking fine dude. I love it, you gotta try it, be cool, get, get hard, fucking rock, man. He loves you. He loves you, ladies and gentlemen. And I love you too, all you dippers out there. So as always, dip on you, silly sons of bitches. Dip on. There it is. No notorious and hydro say notorious and hydro say dip on. Notorious and Hydro say Notorious and Hydro say Dip on you silly sons of bitches